Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, Dance All News and Reviews. If you're new to the channel, drop a subscription. Here we are going for what I going right now, people. Judge the nice bill for music producer, Linval Shopdan Thompson Jr., co-accused. Montego Bay St. James, popular dancer and music producer, Linval Shopdan Thompson Jr., and his murder co-accused, Tajay Clark. Had uh, their renewed bail application denied when they made an appearance in the St. James Circuit Court on Friday. They are set to face trial on January 8th. The two men are accused of the 2022 triple murder of 27-year-old Chadwell Frazier, otherwise called Bombrain, or Chad, 24-year-old Shamario, Chippy Calvin, and the 26-year-old Tonian, to fly read my god my god shop down the producer from the heights of fame to the bottom of the prison cell how did we get here my god my god me now go line up people to say that shop down is a notch on Serpy's belt is an understatement an understatement and me fi tell you about it i mean at the end of the day we always say about shop down but a sir p unveil a sir p take off his mask remember good no man shop down a wear mask before covid and a sir p take that off now if using money likes and links to get people killed with a person it would name linval thompson jr aka shabba or as you may know him, shop done. Well, on the man, we are take a trip down memory lane. We have to do that. After all, we are talking about Shabdan and how we got here. It was Sir P who took him to prison. I mean, not literally, but damn, it, you might as well see a Sir P lock him up. This introduction right here that Sir P gave us, you know, our serious one, you know, right out the gate, the man I make we know said that brother, yeah, our serious killer. That brother, yeah, responsible all heap of people dead. That brother, yeah, our money and power. And him have holy pa links and money, you know. And him have used if he kill all him on a friend them. And we have said, Jesus Christ. That name sound familiar. No, the producer name so. Yes. The producer. But Shabdan, the snake, is not just a music producer. He's also a violence producer. One of the biggest in Mobile. You have to stop and think. Meds it no people. Meds it. Shop a major producer. At the heights of his fame and success. This man Sir P come out and I tell we said that brother ya. I one of the biggest violence producer. In the biggest violence producing parish in Jamaica. Just think about it. Just, just, just meds it. The man make this accusation. This accusation is crazy, but at the end of the day, we the kind of look on shop done crazy because him a wear mask. We hear say him a bad man. We hear say him a done. We hear whole heap of things, but at the end of the day, Sir P come out and him just run and get it to it. Run and cut. An intro. I have to drop no because as it stands, Montego Bay is at boiling point. And any minute, the pot cover I will fly off and shop down the snake is a major factor in this he has been the common denominator right through 87's come and go shooters come and go but the one person has been consistently in the mix pushing the violence funding the violence and instigating the violence is shop down Sir P knew what was to come. It's like the man is a prophet. Me no know what I go on, pan what I go on. Him have a crystal ball or what? The man know say Mobia was a powder keg and that things was gonna turn up and Shopdan was gonna be in the middle of it. But little did Sir P knew how much Shopdan would actually be involved. Way too involved. So now, I forget to drag out of the dark and bring in the light. Because before me even give you know, the Dutch story and the Damage story and the G-Man story and give some examples of the people they must have done, set up and kill many of whom might want to friend them. I want to get something clear. The fact that the snake is not even on a person's of interest list shows you that the Jamaican authorities cannot take it seriously. 
Watch a ball game, you know, you know, people pay real close attention and listen to what I say. You see, Sir P come out and make some accusation against Bright Light Boss, and people are outraged and they're saying, How could he, how this, and how that, and whatever, whatever. Me I say, Member good. When Sir P made the allegations against Shop Dan, he wasn't even a person of interest. He wasn't even on the police, them radar. How was that possible? And Sir P connect the dots. So that is why when people are say, yo, bright light boss, innocent and rare, rare, rare. Me I say, eh? Sir P not just run out and talk. He must know something about something. So me I go kick back and wait and see what really are going on. That sure you say. When me say, is it that them can do it or them no want to do it? Shop down is a perfect example of that. The snake, right? even though you see him in a mask and hat, in the streets, Everybody I'm over here about shop down and what I do. There is no way the police you know who shop down is. Even Uncle Sam. Right? After them all happened him and this side say no what send him back to Jamaica for them problem. Jamaican authorities know about shop down. They know the do. You see what I go on pan what I go on? We just a recap, you know. We just a recap them video yeah? the actual full video them they on Sir P page. All you have to do I go to him channel and type in Shabdan and you will see whole heap of video come up. Whole heap of video where him talk about Shabdan. A long time him want Shabdan before him actually expose Shabdan. A long time him tell Shabdan say Bill, behave and Shabdan never listen and him challenge, him challenge Sir P and you see how that go. But him surround himself with some little hungry belly police. Some little licky licky police who shouldn't care par with the producer and you know get a couple of tickets to go in at the hot party them. No one did them work. You see, me have to do this like a rant before me go into shop down store now because I'm gonna don't don't mix me up with your favorite YouTube. I just call talk about man and call today. Right? We talk about these people because I want things done. Maybe a people who want something done about it. Shop down cannot operate like this. The snake cannot continue right, to slither around Jamaica. You have to give Sir P respect. Even if you are a criminal, you still have to give him respect. The man say out oh, time one and more. Listen to the man, good people. The man says shop down cannot continue to slither around. Something have to be done. And the man never stop and stop until shop down end up behind bars. Him never stop the man out him and mask him, expose him. And all of that led to shop down being behind bars. Well, additionally, he wants stupidity. Watch out, no man, them clippings that we did that play. Those are from the introduction, the unmasking, the video with Sir P unmasked, shop down. Those clippings, those snippets came from that. Right now, we are talking about shop down busting the gun charge. Yeah, we are, we are playing some snippets from the gun charge being bust. Make we address the elephant in the room. Make we address the rhinoceros in the room. There's a reason why the Jamaican public have very little faith in the Jamaican justice system. When people say them can't get a basic gun charge, we're not talking about nothing complex. We're not talking about any of the many murders with the snake responsible for. We're talking about a basic gun charge where them catch him with the gun in him care. Them can't get a conviction upon that. All the mago tell me say, the mago these mankle gangs and the mago uh, get these individuals, the violence producers and at this point I'm sure the entire section of the Jamaican massive, we are in abroad, are chanting. We don't believe it. Yeah man, the elephant, the rhinoceros in the room. Shabdan was arrested and gun charged and in bossy case. Remember good no? Ya yeah, fella? We went from Shabdan being exposed by Sir P to Shabdan being caught with gun to Shabdan busting the case and walking back the streets. And Sir P said, God damn it man, the system can't do its job. How them, how them manage to let him go? How them manage to not even bring no evidence towards the man? No ballistics, not no fingerprint, jeez. Them worthless. Now, as you can see on your screen, dancer producer, Shab Snake, has been freed in the gun court, firearm and ammunition charges. The 31-year-old was freed, right, after no evidence was offered against him. No evidence 
was awful against him. You see when Shabdan bust that case, yeah, my god, people celebrate, you know? A whole heap of people laugh after Serpy, you know? The, yo, the dance are fan them, no for them, the Gaza fans, them, them clown Serpy, them laugh after Serpy. Yeah, man, Shabdan the road, you idiot, you bad mind, you bad mind, the man, I chew the man this and the man that and rate it, eh? Right now, who have the last laugh? No. If you really think some of you spooky before, wait till you see what's going to happen next. This has taken the Mobile War to a whole different level. Now you might be thinking, well, things were already dangerous. People did already a drop like fly. Just how much worse can it get? So when we reach right now, the triple murder video. Yeah man, the triple murder, we are going to land shop down behind bars. Well, you see, one of the ways in how you can estimate how extreme retaliation is going to be is when you look at how close the people that were dead are to the people that were running the gang. This whole thing is crazy, you know, unbelievably, you know. Shabdan went from a man with us, a produce music, and we are here, same link to things, to a man with gone pan hops and get caught up. Yo, what the? What? I hope you're sorry, you're the man. I want go on. How this happen? Thursday, there was a youth named Jay, man. It was his birthday. People are celebrate, I drink them liquor, play them music. But you know it got ready. Chicken Mary. At the near. Some 87s from the unknown gang pull up on them. Now, maybe you hear me mention the word unknown, and you think me I try to say nobody don't know uh, who. That's not the case. As some real Netflix series, this, you know? As some real Netflix series, this, you know? I will write them script yeah. You can't tell me say them thing in real life. I script people, I script out them thing yeah. Somebody I write. If this whole thing with Serpy and Shop Dan is a freaking movie. It's a movie in itself. And right now, me just, me just I watch the movie. I, I, I unveil, I, I reveal, I, I show it to it. Like, this is, this is crazy. Unknown is the name of the gang. These are a group of known criminals who call themselves unknown. Make that make sense. Anyway, the leader of the unknown gang is the snake. You would have seen me cover many videos talking about the snake. Him still a road, a dream thing. And the GCT youth them, right, a Fred man them say. Shabdan is a major reason why enough people do not question Serpy. No fight time you might have said, yo, yo, I don't know what Serpy I get him in for from. I don't know if him thing real, I don't know if him legit, I don't know if man make it up, you know. Ray, 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 rah, rah, rah. But at the end of the day, we go down with Shabdan, you say, no man, Serpy, him clairvoyant. Him have a crystal ball. Him know what go on. No, this man attack some real things because we see what play out with Shab Dan. So recently, there was a triple murder in the parish. We tell him to say an unknown man named carry it out. We know we have more information. When this triple murder took place, you know, and Sir P came out and said it was unknown gang who carry out this murder, you know, and everybody has said, no man, yo, all your fear says shop down link to that and ray ray ray, a bag of people are bash a beat Sir P. But look ya you now. Not only was the operation carried out by unknown, but the snake himself was on that operation. How crazy and insane this is that not only was it unknown gang, Shabdan was actually allegedly on the scene. Him shoot and kill allegedly he was a part of the murder squad. How crazy is this? And right now he's behind bars. He's charged with murder, triple murder, facing trial coming up January the 8th. And on a joke thing, this denied bail once again. Fatted was also on that operation. You see, when I have to understand, them you tell, even time on the thing say, well, they show him learn him less now. He in get ready already, so he got chill. They like you can't chill. When they like you criminals boss case, you know what happened to them? Them start to feel even more invincible. Memo Maras, Sir P, you must profit. How you know, sir, brother? How you didn't know, sir, the man ain't go cool? How you know, sir, the man did go get caught up again? Jesus Christ. Shaba, why you do it, Shaba? Allegedly, still, we don't know, we don't know. 
We are way up on court date. So this is what they're gonna teach you, right? In your course. You think 787 get there? Right. After doing a shooting, and then police hold on upon him, get charged, and then be the case. You're thinking, right? That means say, you might well just relax now because see, him get away. Honestly, me did a pre say Shaba was gonna chill. Me nae know say man woulda get caught up. I was shocked. Me, me couldn't believe it. Me still not believe it. It is, it is unbelievable. Like me can't fathom it. Like really, bro, you get off, you beat that they charge day, and you gonna get caught up in a something far worse. It's like Serpies, yo, the man dream come true, like, yeah, man, you bugger, yo. You get off on a regular gun charge where you da get like a two, three year. Instead, you run up in a triple murder. That's a triple murder? No, sir. What actually happened is, them start to think, you know what, sir? Be untouchable. We could try it again. Just like a bad picnic. When they do something and then get away with it, then try it again. And then try it again. And then keep pushing them luck, pushing them luck until them luck run out. Hmm, untouchable. Where did I hear that? Oh, okay. Bright light boss say I'm untouchable. Okay. He might push him luck. Hmm. We're going to see what I'm going to go on. I wonder if Sir P, I'm going to break him down like how Sir P break down shop down. Hmm. Who knows? The youth named J-Man. He is such a high value target that the snake and fatted personally took part in the operation. Normally, they may not send them like 87s, right? In a mobile to go take care of certain things. But because J-Man was there, right? He was behind bars recently, touched back the road. Them one personally say, them killed J-Man. I don't know you know if the man you know learn from history, you know. You have some king we want to ride up on them horse and lead the attack, you know. <laughs> Me I tell you no, no fight time, you know, when the boss them get them hands dirty, I saw them get caught up. <laughs> yeah man, mm -hmm. no plausible deniability when you get your hands dirty. But well, ironically, the man with the more and kill the most is the man we survive. So immediately the investigators them start to put together them case. But I don't know, say, the system coming like a strainer. People in the system get information back to the snake that is about to be called in and arrested. Once again, the system is leaking. Leaking like water commission PBC pipe them. Boss, <laughs> how to mean? Wally for information flow. Reach to Shaba, Shaba could have escaped, want to fly out and all them things there because information reach him. People are leak, people are talk. And you wonder why people don't go to the authorities to report nothing. Because at the end of the day, they are just putting a target a bullseye on themselves. Obviously. So the snake, realizing, say, this time he might not so lucky for boss no more case, start making preparations for leave the island. Now you might be wondering, but me did hear say the more lamp on the snake passport when to leave the island. Come on people, you don't need no passport to leave Jamaica. Is it just me or this son reminiscent of you know Vibes Cartel? When they wanted to fly out and roo 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 and rah rah rah. Sound familiar, right? My god, my god, my god, my god. When you have the kind of money and connections with the snake of they can leave Jamaica right, without even a driving license, much less a passport. So of course it was going to be illegally. Because even though him know say them never call him in, him no know just how much them have on him. And that right there sir is what everybody have to wait and see. You hear that? And remember, say you're innocent until proven guilty, you know? Remember, and even when verdict is rendered, even if you're guilty, there's always privy counsel, you understand? So when man have money, you know that go already. Anything is possible. Tamper with jura, buy out the case, buy out the hey, the judge, hey, anything is possible. So nobody feels say it's certified that shop Dan won't come back a road. <laughs> you have to remember that. Including the snake. See, what was supposed to happen is they were going to put out that the snake is a person of interest right, 
are wanted and then they be the like usual wanted man thing where them wait for your hand in yourself. The reason why them go for this snake is because I said the intel come down say you might go try to leave the island. And if the snake left Jamaica, you know that guy ready. Where that I tell you say, if you listen good, both sides are leak, both sides have informants. You have to remember good. So people in a shop done team. Mm-hmm. A leak. Some of them a leak. Some of them send information to the authorities. Say yo, shop done a look for leaving them. A look for make a move. You know, so now for running quick, you know. And you know, people on the other side, the police them side, send information to shop and say yo, you have to go move, you know, because them above for running by you, you know. You see what I go on, what I go on? Leakings. If you are fatted, cut. Because the two of them are planned for life. No. Even though you hear say the snake is in custody, but I know you should have known say, that in itself that means say, he might even get charged. Because they might have a certain amount of things before they can even say they will go press charges against him. And I'm hoping say at least this time they might have the investigation started out. And that should be the case because MID is involved. And if you don't know who MID is, that's the major investigation division. So the fact that they are involved. And they actually played a role in the arrest. That show me say they probably have something on the snake. Jamaica corrupt, corrupt from top to bottom, top to bottom. Anyhow, shop down people. Member good no man. From a producer that was just hiding his face to a man behind bars facing triple murder and other crimes and all of these things. Sir P, Sir P, Sir P. And the fact that he was willing. Right. For runway from Jamaica means that in probably years say they have something solid upon him. No MID usually wait a little, get them case, get them evidence, and then them go arrest. Right. But because the snake was about to leave the island, I don't know if it basically forced them on out quickly before him leave and then they get if they have everything they need if they actually hold on upon him. So we have to go see how that work out. People, it's a waiting game. Will Shabba, will Shabdan actually be convicted or not? Will he walk road? Will he change his ways if he's actually guilty? Will he change his ways if he's found guilty? Will he find a new path? Will he leave the destruction, the acidity, the crime and violence? Who knows? But in my opinion, if the snake get Lego, then that's probably it. You know, go put left Jamaica. And as we know, once people left Jamaica, it look like say the government does give up on them. Even though Jamaica can't extradite people, the same way you see Uncle Sam extradite people to America. Whether they're Jamaicans or American citizens who run over Jamaica, Uncle Sam send for people. But for some reason it look like say the Jamaican government can't find their tradition papers. So the most wanted of man just fly out, steer foreign, and just ring on death and destruction. And the security forces tell us that they know us are him, but you know, the papers are sent for extradite. That is it, people. You see what I go on, pan what I go on. You see me? Shopdan get caught up, Sir P exposed Shopdan, and now Shopdan is behind bars facing triple murder charges. You see me? That go on. Yeah, man, another Sir P alone exposed him, you know. On the spot, media and, you know, my view and other people's way, you know, like minded vloggers as Sir P and on the spot, media would say. But you get what I go on, pan what I go on. So when you hear the matter about bright light boss right now, me I say, is this another Shabba? Is this another person who will be broken down and eventually we will see them behind bars or in, or in the courts? I don't know, you know. I don't know. Either way, people, subscribe to the channel. Member good no man, drop a comment. Yeah, hit the like button. And make sure to subscribe to Jamaica Breaking News and my channel that as well. Content every day. Make sure to check out that Jamaica Breaking News. Me go pin the link in the comments. Do the right thing. Big up on yourself. Vulture Squad, I'm out.